What's up, guys? It's Don. Um, thank you, S9999 Frank. He uh, submitted a comment saying I should uh, retest doing 35 to 40 amps. Um, that's a great idea. Stress the batteries a little bit more, see if we can uh, squeeze a little more difference between the standard 25C and the Nanotex. So uh, thank you for your comment, and uh, here's your video. So I'm running a, a much higher power system here. I've got a 60 amp speed control, which is overkill because I'm only doing 41 amps average. But um, this is a, an arc motor. It's actually kind of a rare motor designed by a, a local guy around here in California. But uh, it's a 28 millimeter can. It's a 47, 47 tall. And it's a two turn, so it's a 2170 kV motor. This was my, my big motor for my uh, my pusher, my Easy Star, when I had that thing weighed way down with a camera and such. But uh, it's a it's an Uber motor for sure. But this thing I'm running, what was it, a six by five point five prop with the sixty amp speed control. I'm a total wussy. This thing scares the hell out of me, to be honest. It uh, it spins up and it's it's loud and powerful and scary. And the uh, last thing I want to do is be anywhere near it. So you can see I'm not using the uh, not using the servo tester, I actually walked off out of the room and used my uh, my transmitter, but uh, you know, whatever, so I like my hands. So here's the results. The uh, the standard 25 did uh, uh, 465.3 watts, wide open throttle. The Nanotech, 484. Nuts. Totally different. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and um, die paper die.